I'm Arvelyn Lewis and I sell real estate. I'm here today at my good friend Sarah's open house and I'm going to take you in and show you what this house looks like because it's quite the gorgeous home, quite a stunner. So I'm going to go up these stairs and uh, bear with me because there's quite a few. I started in the middle of the staircase just so I wouldn't have to walk up so many in this heat. It is out here but here I come I'm going to the steps going up the steps just a couple more hang in there with me all right we're at the door so here we go this is what it looks like when you first step in you're greeted with the more stairs actually but up there it's a chandelier and a wonderful staircase and on my left is the formal dining room and you see the inlays on the floor. And over here on the right, actually that's my left, might be your right, is a parlor. So if you've got to visit with some friends or just have a, a meeting, this would be the formal parlor that you might want to do that in. And right here is a butler pantry so that if you are serving your friends or your guests or whomever it is that you're conducting business with in the parlor, you have space here or a wine chiller or refrigerator or something so that you don't have to go all the way into your kitchen to serve something cool to your guests. Here we have the family room or space to visit where everybody gathers. And there's Sarah. Don't worry, I'm just listening to my vintage Chinese the radio. <laughs> An accessory found in this beautiful home as the owner has started to depart. There we have the front door and the fireplace that warms up the entire house. Beautiful space there. Can lights over the whole family room and above me there is a fan blowing overlooking that beautiful screened in porch. We'll step out there in a moment as we go through this kitchen. You see on the left and the right, there is a little, um, I don't think that's gonna be called a butler pantry, but there's just little spaces that um, provide some uh, places to store your beverages, your knickknacks, or whatever it is that you wanna store in those spaces. But here, the kitchen, we've got a island in the middle with a vegetable sink and a breakfast space. We've got a KitchenAid, uh, can't call it Sub-Zero, but it is the wider space KitchenAid refrigerator. Great cabinet space and countertop space. Interesting thing here is there are dual dishwashers perhaps we're just guessing it was designed for a family uh, that might have jewish traditions where there needs to be separate dishwasher um, spaces to clean certain things KitchenAid range with six burners dual oven you've got one there and one there as well as the microwave stainless steel hood and beautiful backsplash. As we walk through, again, we've got another butler pantry where you're staging and setting up to serve in the formal dining room there, the pantry. You can walk in here. Wonderful cabinet space to store and keep things. Plenty of space for the butler's service and staging for wonderful dinners in the formal dining room. See that inlay on the floor, hardwood floor throughout the home. It is quite a statement home. Plantation shutters with uh, 
the very thick wood. We're not playing around with the lighting and the um, different ambiance that this home has for you. On my left, as I pass this closet, it is a closet the way it's set up, but it is also space where an elevator can be installed to go to all three levels of this house. And now we'll cross over into the keeping room. This is a keeping room area that allows for another entry into the home in addition to the one that's at the front door. And as I said earlier, we're going to step out onto this enclosed screened porch. And it has a courtyard over here. Nice trellis over an area. I would probably have a kitchen installed there or grill. But it's a beautiful courtyard to just have some wonderful entertaining going on out there. And again, this wonderful screened in porch. Isn't that nice? So as we go back into the house, up here we have an au pair suite. I'm gonna run up there. I'm gonna try not to make you dizzy as I run up these stairs really quick. Not as quick as I would like to go because I'm not as young as I used to be, but this is the au pair suite, a separate area above and off to the back of the home, the nanny, au pair, whoever you'd like to call it, the maid, might live in this area. There is a full bathroom here. Full bath. And bath and shower. Okay. So if you don't have a nanny, this might be where you keep your guests so that they feel like they have a private space. It could also be a multi-generational home where the teens are up this way or the young adults as they're starting their own family. And then there's the basement area. Let's go there now. Let's see. Here's the basement area. There's a bathroom back over there in that corner too. But you've seen a bathroom before, you know what they look like. Here is another area. It could be a bedroom, but there's no closet, so it's not legally a bedroom, but it is a great space. It does have window. They're staging this currently to have a sale of the things that remain in the home. That back there is the storage, actually utility space. So all the HVACs and water heaters are there. Full bathroom. Okay. And here, this could actually be a full on apartment because there's this living room space that's here, kitchenette, space for a refrigerator. Lots of space over here as well. And if we peek out here, there is a grotto. You don't see these very often, but it's a great space to just chill out in the winter and the spring and uh, hide out. It's a nice space. Don't you think it's wonderful? There's one more room that I'd like to show you. And it's over here. There's some storage space under the stairs there. And here we have yet another bedroom for sure because there are some window spaces here. And there is a closet there. So we definitely get to call this a bedroom. And again, these are the things that are going to be sold in the home sale that's coming. It's an estate sale that's coming up in a few days. So 
this is what's available to check out. And this is the city of Atlanta. I'm Arvelyn Lewis. I sell real estate. And again, this listing is of my friend, Sarah. If you'd like to buy it, call me. I'd love to help you and be your realtor.